How's it going everyone, Bainy here, and in this quick video, I'm gonna demonstrate how people who own lawn mowing businesses or lawn care businesses, any, anything sort of like that, can start running Facebook ads today for very, very cheap to attract new customers into their business every day like clockwork. So before I get started, guys, if you do find this video useful, please give me a subscribe and a thumbs up. Thanks, guys. So let's just jump straight into it. I'm gonna show you how to set up ads exactly from scratch. Uh, whether you have a website or not, I'm gonna show you two different completely ad, two completely different ads. I'm gonna start with, um, let's say that you do have a website. I'm gonna I'm gonna create an ad first. So let's jump in and have a look. So if you don't know what all this is, this is the Facebook Business Manager. I'm not gonna go over it. If you don't know how to set this up, go back through some of my other videos and, and learn how to set this up. It's all very basic. Uh, so we come down here to the ads man and we wanna create an ad from scratch. So we just go to the big green create button. So I'm gonna create an ad, this is for website. If you've got a website and you wanna direct people to a website or you think it'll be useful for them to see a website, we wanna to go to conversions. Just type in conversions down here and go lawn care. Something very simple like that, it doesn't really matter. Up here you wanna go again, lawn care. Actually, you can probably put con for conversions, then lawn care and then we'll leave that blank for now. Uh, so what this is, this is your Facebook Pixel. If you don't have this installed on your website, you need to have the Facebook Pixel installed on your website before doing this. If you don't know how to do that, go back through one of my other videos to show you how to do that, or you might have to just Google your, you know, what type of website yours is and, and how to install the Pixel, but you must install that Pixel on your website before going ahead. And then just create whichever one, uh, and then come down here and pick conversion event, uh, usually view content or page view, something very basic should pop up there. It might be red, that's fine. Uh, it just means it hasn't been fired yet, that's, that's, that's all good. So once all that's in and ready to go, um, and like I said, it doesn't have to be green, uh, it can be red. And we wanna come down here and create offer. So select the page, your page would obviously be whatever page yours is. And, and we wanna create an offer. So. For perfect for a, a lawn mine business would be 50% off, right? It might seem harsh, but like if you gain a customer out of this and they do three or four, um, you know, they get your services once a month and it's it's obviously worth it in the end. So 50% off. Um, call today. Today. Or 50% off. So details, just um, more info about your product. So you'd fill that out with whatever. Uh, the end date would be obviously a date you wanna, you put an end date. Online, uh, people can reach this is where you put your website. So we'll just go Google for now. But obviously you put your website in there. You could, you could have no code or one code, you could say your lawn business was called Pro Lawn. You just go, you know, Pro 50 for 50% 50 off. You know, it doesn't it doesn't really matter. Just when they ring up, say, do you have a code? And it just means that they came from your ad and it's just easy to track it. So you go Pro 50 here as well. Essentially, you want to get people to ring you because then you can book straight away. If they visit your website, unless they can book off your website, uh, it's probably a lot harder to close them, but if they ring you straight away uh, and they're gonna want the 50% off discount, they're gonna have to give you the code. So just a much better way to do it. T's and C's, uh, you just write new customers only or something like that. New clients only. And the cool thing about these offers is once someone um, claims it and saves it for later, what Facebook will do is it will send them notifications and say, hey, you still haven't claimed your offer yet. It'll send them emails as well. So this will be filled in with whatever picture you decide to put in your ad. Um, you know, and, and everything about the order. So Facebook's gonna keep reminding them to claim the offer. So it's, it's really, really powerful. If you've got your um, product in front of someone's face all the time and Facebook's continually reminding them to say, hey, look, you know, you got this offer, let's use it. And then you just go create offer. Now that that's done, we'll come down here and you want to type in your address pretty much or wherever your business is located. So we'll just for an example do Station Street and under. It's the one I like to use a lot. And you could you could narrow down your just to a couple miles. 
So there's, there's let's say that's your business. You want to target people that are a couple miles from your business. Uh, you want to probably, if you're a lawn mowing care company, you want to probably target people of the older age because they just can't be bothered doing it. That leaves you with 100,000 in your local area. If you wanted to, you could even go down to one mile from your, still leaves you 42,000. That's plenty though, that's a decent, decent area to cover um but you, you could you could just play around with that to be honest and in, in the, to start off with i would just leave that uh men and women put english there i would probably leave this blank to start with uh and just run it for a couple of days and see what sort of interest i got out of it uh if i didn't if i didn't get too many people interested i would put an interest in there maybe lawn lawn care if you can do that um Long, Scott's Lawn Care, less than a thousand people, probably not the idea. You can just type in Lawn. It's going to get you two and a half thousand people within that range. And then obviously you'd make that bigger. You'd, you'd, you'd add that to 15, maybe not 15 miles, that's pretty far. Maybe 10 miles would be fine. And it'd be 48 miles. So you can play around with that part, different ads over the weeks, and just see which one goes the best. But then once you've done that, this will probably be ticked. Uh, you you want to untick that um, because you don't you don't want to be targeting a million people. It's just it's just not going to work. So untick that. Here in this is your placement, so where you want to place the ads. Uh, if you've got an Instagram page, yeah, put it on Instagram. I usually just leave all these ticked unless I don't have an Instagram, then I would untick Instagram. But I don't have mine connected up, so um, it's unticked already. So leave all that the way it is. I would recommend starting on $5 a day doing two ads. So have a budget of about at least $150 to $300. You want, you want to be doing two ads at $5 a day per ad um, and just see what sort of results they get. You want, you want two ads going because you want to test one ad against the other. You want to target different age groups in one ad and then you want to target. So in this one here, you would go 30 to 65. So 30 to 65 no interests no interest because we're going to leave that blank and then we'll just and then you might call it one kilometer one mile four miles it doesn't really matter four miles so but then on your next ad the next ad you do you might put an interest in there so you'd go 30 to 65 interest lawn change that to lawn you up that to 10 miles so you'd have two ads running at the same time um, two totally different things so one's targeting lawn 10 miles away the other one has no interest with four miles away you know you could change a million different things in that in this in this section here to um just test and see which one goes the best um, now you've done that so yeah two two ads five dollars a day Set the start and end date, whichever ones you want to do. You really want to, you really just want to keep your ads going all month. You don't want to, you want to set a monthly budget because you just don't want to turn your ads off. You want them consistently running because then your ads are consistently being shown to people, right? So if you set a monthly budget of three hundred dollars, um, on average, if you're getting, you should your ads should be shown to roughly thirty thousand people, out of which you know depending on how good your ad is not everyone's going to pay attention to it but on average they're going to be shown to thirty thousand people within that month so just brand awareness brand awareness for your business is going to skyrocket because thirty thousand more people are going to be exposed to your business so it's going to be it's going to be um it's definitely going to at least get you some more phone calls it should at least get you some more phone calls anyway um here you want to go one day click or view especially for this offer and then this, that's that section complete. Up here, you can you can leave that. You can you can change this to the same as what the other page was. On no interests, and then the age, whatever the ages were. So sixty-five, two miles, 
whatever it was. Just just to keep it all congruent and everything, stuff like that. So here's where you create the ad. You pick, you pick your page at the top. Your page should be already there. Um, so you probably, if you've got a few good pictures and videos, you can make a carousel. But if you've got one good video, one good picture, you just go uh, this one here, single image. Obviously, just add the image. This is one I uploaded earlier. So just a nice one of a house with a, a good lawn. Obviously, you'd use one of the, you know, one of the um, pictures from one of your clients or something like that. Obviously, you'd have that sorted out. So we come down here, uh, and this is where you put the um, the words that go above the above your pictures. So what what I would do is if you're in Nanda and you're you know, your, your business in Nunda, I'll write Nunda homeowners, tired of mowing your own lawn, question mark. And then so anyone in Nunda that's tired of mowing their own lawn, <laughs> tired of mowing their own lawn, are obviously going to stop and pay attention to your ad. We'd rather sit back and relax on the weekend instead of sweating it out in the backyard, because no one likes doing that, right? Why not get Lawn Pro to take care of all your lawn, lawn needs? We have a special offer for new clients only. Buy any lawn care package today and receive 50% off. Simply click the lock, you know, just just tell, you want to tell them what to do, you not just expect them to know. I know it might sound stupid, um, but always tell them what you want them to do. Simply click the get offer link below and give us a call. You know, walk them through it, give us a call, make a booking, use the, use the code because I know it might seem obvious to a lot of people, but if you don't tell them what to do, they won't do it. So it's as simple as that. So, and then obviously put your, website in here and then when they click that it'll take them to their website it take them to your website and and it'll bring up the offer for the 50 percent off and then they can call you and, and give you the code and then you can say cool come from here um facebook tracking pixel uh this is what i talked about earlier if this isn't set up on your website you need to do this you need to find out how to uh, install the facebook pixel on your website uh if you've got a wordpress site go into my channel i've got a video on how to do it um but if you're it's not a WordPress site, just Google whatever the name of your site is, install Facebook Pixel and, and some videos will come up on how to do it. But you have to do that before running ads or you just, um, especially if you've got a website or you just, you know, it's just a waste of money. And then it's just a matter of confirming it and um, waiting for the business to roll in. So that's how you do it if you had a website. I'm going to quickly run over how to do it if you don't have a website because you don't have links to websites and you don't have stuff like that. It's a little bit different, but it's very similar. Um, so we'll just go back to the very start. Instead of going to conversions, we'd go to engagement. Same, same, same as before. Lawn, you know, whatever you want to call it. All this stuff's the same as what we did before. Name that, change this to the local area. Um, leave all this blank or you could change it to put lawn or, you know, exactly like we did before. It's exactly the same before. Uh, edit placement, if you don't have an Instagram page, undo it. Uh, budget, $5, set the date. You know, all this stuff is the same. It's just when you get to this last page, when you create the ad. This is a good thing about engagement. If you've got a Facebook page and you've done a few posts and some of those posts have got a lot of attention, then you can simply grab one of those posts and turn it into an ad. So this is the ads. These are the posts that are on my page. You can simply just grab one of these, continue, and it's going to bring up the um, the post straight there. So, but if you don't have um, many posts on your page, you can just create a, create one from scratch, just like we did earlier. So, video or image, it's exactly like we did before. Hopefully, that's still paste. Yep. So, because this doesn't have the big get offer um, section like the other ad did, you want to put it in these first three lines because that's the only three lines that show on Facebook now. So homeowners, number homeowners, get 50% of lawn care needs today. And then you can just leave the rest as is, really. Tired of mowing your own lawn? You, you could you, you could literally leave the rest. Um, here, because you say, because it's different, call us today on 
five, 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 whatever your, your number is. Um, mention this add to receive to get 50% off your next booking. And it's simple as that. Um, if you wanted to, you could say send message and you could write, so we'll put down a send message button here and you could tell people to message us today, you know, message us today on message us today and mention this ad to get 50% off your next book in. You know, there's heaps of different things you could do here. Um, learn more. These Most of these will re require a website. Uh, get quote, learn more, shop now, and WhatsApp if you've got WhatsApp. Send message doesn't. It will just automatically go to, go to your messenger. So it's very, very cool. Good way to um, interact with customers very easily. So that's, that's a good one to use. Um, or you could just do no button, um, put your number there, and you know, and get them to get them to call you. So there's heaps of different ways. I'll just let you play around with that and all the different things you can do. But that's essentially how you should run Facebook ads on how to set them up from scratch if you had a lawn care business, guys. So if you found this video useful, please give me a subscribe, hit the thumbs up, share with it, share this with a friend, start using this today and let me know how it goes. Uh, it's only going to cost you 5 to $10 a day to test this out. And if you get a couple new clients out of it per month, um, and they stay with you for a year, two years, three years, then obviously that's going to be massive rewards for you. So let me know how it got. Uh, let me know how it goes in the comments. Uh, feel free to reach out to me on Facebook, Instagram, YouTube if you need any help setting this up. Uh, I will do it for a fee. But obviously you can see how simple it is. I've just shown you how to do it. You can do it all yourself very, very easily. So like I said, guys, if you like this video, thumbs up, hit the subscribe, and I'll see you on the next video. Thanks, guys.